don't bring your partner's weakness to the open room at a certain time after some activities hi guys welcome back to Telma says I know that um, a lot of people are still stocked up on their exes it's why I'm going to be doing this video all right so here's what I'll tell you stop staying stuck on your past just because a relationship didn't work does not mean that another one will not work there's nothing wrong with you there's nothing wrong with who you are there's nothing wrong if you know that you have some flaws that's okay we all do we all have weaknesses also we do have strengths so there's nothing wrong with you but what you need to do is you need to stop now stop you need to stop crying and stop worrying and stop pitying yourself over a relationship that didn't work out just because it didn't work out does not mean the next one will not work out. You've, you've put up too much effort, you know, regretting things that you did before. Thrash all of that. What I think you can do instead, you can start making efforts. If you made some mistakes in the past, all right, that's fine. What you need to do is you need to start working on your next relationship. Give somebody the opportunity to love you. Open up yourself. It is in relating with someone new that you will be sure, you will know that you are correcting the mistakes of the past. The things that you did, the errors that you made in your next relationship, correct it. But don't cry, don't sit down and pity yourself, don't sit down and feel bad. Move on to the next person. There's someone who's looking at you and wondering how, when is this person going to give me an opportunity to love them the way they need to be loved. Open up yourself, love somebody, correct your mistakes, move ahead. Even if the next one fails, so what? There's nothing wrong with that. Keep moving until you eventually find the right one. You do that, correct yourself, put yourself in order, pray to God, and you will find, absolutely, you will find somebody who will love you just the way you are because you're amazing, you're beautiful, you are handsome and you deserve 100% love. And of course you are going to find it, but you need to stop worrying. You need to stop crying. You need to stop regretting. Now, make the conscious effort to fall in love again. Okay, my name is Thelma Benson and this is Thelma Says. Make sure that you comment, like and share this video. I want to know what you think about it, alright? See you.